Good morning to you and welcome back. I'm Shelby Coates and Lil G joins us for 41 Top Entertainment. Hey Shelby, how you doing? I'm doing great. Happy Friday to you. <laughs> Same to you. Let's she go. Giggles this morning. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get started with our entertainment. We have to start off with Atlanta's own Ludacris. He has an announcement. Hey, the Fast and Furious star made his big announcement on this past Monday. He is now truly a a girl dad. He has oh, four girls. Yeah. So on Monday, they welcomed a new girl to the family. Uh, her name is, uh, what is it? Her name is, uh, how do you say this? Um, Chance o Oyali Bridges. I hope yes. that's right, or Ludacris is going to get you. <laughs> so, yeah, this is one of the four, two with his wife now. And uh, they're just celebrating it, and he's very happy to be a girl dad. Man, time is flying. Four kids. I did not even know that. All know, right, we also have a lot to celebrate with Beyonce. Hey, have you seen the cover of Harper's Bazaar uh, Icon magazine? I have not. I'm telling you, you've been missing out on social media because Beyonce has been putting every fashion uh, picture that she has on the magazine on social media. So she's going to cover the September edition of Harper's Bazaar Icon magazine, and it is awesome, man. She has seven different outfits that she's going to wear, and uh, she talks about her mental healthness and how during the pandemic she had to get her mind together, and now her daughters can really see her for who she really is, not just a uh, star. I like it, and I will check it out. Also, um, she's a Virgo, so September's her birthday month, so that's pretty interesting there, too. Definitely. All righty, Angela Bassett, another powerful woman. What do we know? I'm so proud of Angela Bassett, man. I had I didn't even know this. Do you watch the series 911? I do, and I'm obsessed with it. I love it, man. Well, now Angela Bassett just signed a new contract, and she's the highest paid woman of color to ever make $450,000 per episode, Shelby. Kudos to her. She is amazing in that show. She's an ama amazing actress, period. So I'm very happy for her. Hey, you think Brandon would give me $450,000 per episode of the Entertainment Report? <laughs> I will let you ask him about that. <laughs> we'll have to wait and see. All right, and finally, tell us a little bit about the woman who used a billboard in Atlanta to get Tyler Perry's attention for a part. So about two years ago, a, a woman put a post on the billboard in Atlanta saying, Tyler Perry, I'm an actress. I need your, I need you to put me on, la da 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 put her email, her Facebook, all that information on there. Tyler Perry came back and criticized the woman for doing that. He said, don't do things like that to grab my attention. You have to follow the process just like everybody else. Well, here we are now. Tyler Perry has now signed her on as the lead in one of his shows that is coming out. Hmm, so maybe he didn't like it, but her talent spoke for itself, and now she has a role. She said they never speak about the billboard. They never talk about it. It's just one of those things they put behind them. But, yeah, she's great. All right, G. Well, thank you so much for joining us for entertainment today. Hey, thank you for having me, Shelby. <laughs> 